Let me find the right problem. Here we go. Solid iron reacts with aqueous nickel to chloride. All right. All we right. don't like words. We're chemists. All right. So first of all, I'm gonna just going to make a little scratch pad here, okay. a little box. This is not part of the answer. I'm just going to write down I have iron. Mm-hmm. And I have aqueous nickel 2. Now, nickel 2. Nickel 2, that's Ni with the plus 2 charge. Ni with the plus 2 the charge. Roman numeral indicates what, Mr. Bergman? The charge! Hey, those of you out there who um, are copying your worksheets, you know how I know when you're copying it? When you don't know what the, the Roman numeral indicates, the charge! It's the charge. Yeah. What's it? It's the charge. Okay. And Cl has a charge of minus 1 from the periodic table. Okay. Now, iron, by the way, is going to have a charge. You look at this table right here. When you find iron, you'll notice his charge is three positive. Now, he actually doesn't have a three positive charge. Yet. It becomes three positive. Now, actually, let's first of all decide who's the best looking character here. Okay. So we've got iron. I had him circled. And nickel. OK. So iron is better looking than nickel. He's higher on the chart, right? Yep. And so if that's the case. Iron will go with chloride. And so iron we'll doesn't have it. So we're, this is going to work. This is going to be a work one. This, right. uh, we're going to say iron, F-E. No charge there, because it's just solid iron. Right, just solid iron. Oh, so let's put a little S there. Put the solid. Yeah. Plus aqueous nickel 2 chloride. So that'd be N-I-C-L-2, because to get the charge to add up to zero, you need to have two chlorides, and that's aqueous. Now we're going to trade partners. Now I'm going to look at my box. What are you going to look at, Mr. Sams? The box. The box to determine what the formula. Now we're going to put the iron with the chloride. Glad I got that right. I didn't know quite what you yeah. set me up to say. <laughs> and then that is going to be FeCl3 because to get the charges to add up to zero, well, it's FeCl3. Yeah. Right? Plus, poor nickel, he gets kicked out. Yeah. And there it is. That is the answer, uh, not including the uh, states of matter. This will be an aqueous, and the nickel will be a solid. And then we got to play the charge or the uh, balance equation game. Uh, the most complex one, probably this one. This yeah. is about the same. Um, but we've got a chlorine problem. We mm -hmm. got three here and two here. When I see a three, three I think six. of six, so I go two here, and I go three there, and that's going to mess up my iron. Two irons, so I'm going to go fix on this side, and so that's two. And that this messes up my nickel, so I put a three, three here. So I just back and forth on that balance. Back game. and forth. Okay. Back and forth. Back and forth. Back and forth. Okay, aqueous lithium bromide. Lithium bromide. Let's make a box. Scratch pad. Scratch pad box. Lithium is a charge of plus one mm -hmm. from the periodic table. Yeah. Bromide is negative one. Mm -hmm. Now, the solid reason lithium iron. has a charge is because it's in an ion compound. And we have solid iron that has no charge. charge. Now, wait a second. Lithium. Uh, something about lithium. Lithium. Lithium's hot. Lithium's like the Ow! hottest guy. Lithium's got all the best. So, lithium always gets the girl, so to speak, right? Yep. Guess what? Lithium bromide. Lithium has the girl. No so, reaction. So no reaction. Lithium's already You could say LIBR plus FE, but the answer is no reaction. No reaction. And it's, this is one to one because, of course, one positive and one negative. But no reaction because he's already got the girl. He keeps her. Yeah. If he doesn't have her, he gets her. Yep. Yeah. Sorry, Iron. Yeah. You That's are it. not I think We'll do one more, Mr. Sams. Okay. Aqueous aluminum nitrate. Oh, we got a little poly ion. This mm. is good. All right. Box. Start with the box. The box. Scratch pad. All right. Aluminum. A L plus three. From the periodic table, he's a charge of three positive. Nitrate's a poly ion. Look at the back of your table or wherever you've got your. Minus list. one charge. And barium. solid barium. No charge. All right. So we go to barium. All right, you cannot it. have an ion that is a solid. Right. This is the girl has the negative charge, and so this is positive three. So let's look at aluminum and barium on our little chart here. Okay, Oops. I gotta find that chart there. You know, you know. There, there it is. is. All right. So barium is here. Mm -hmm. Who was the other one? Aluminum. Aluminum. Thank you. Aluminium. It's right here. Okay. Barium's gonna get the girl. Yeah. Barium. All right. Does barium have the girl now? No. Barium's by himself. Okay. So this is gonna work. All right. So I'm gonna write Al. No three. Because when we get the charge to add up to zero and put and that's together, aqueous. And that's aqueous. Plus BA. Plus BA. Makes. Makes. Now, what's the charge uh, of barium? Barium is, makes plus two ions. He'll turn into barium plus two. You can look on your periodic table to right. time that. So I'm going to put the barium with the nitrate. So that's going to make BANO32. Two. And then aluminum gets just aluminum. You lose the no charge. No charge on aluminum now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very. All right, that's we're done. Let's yeah, do wait, some charges. You know what, let's go back. This is AQ, and this is solid. Let's go back to our table here. I decided I was a magnesium earlier, right? Yes. Remember when I wore my kilt last week? Yes. I think that bumped me up to a calcium. You're wearing a dress, Mr. It Sam. was a kilt. 
It was a dress. It was International Day. I wore a kilt. I think it bumps you down to cobalt. Or oh, come on. <laughs> All right. Let's you know, <laughs> my wife actually told me she would never go out in public with me if I was wearing a kilt. See? I stand I stand uh, uh, I justified. Know. I think it's pretty. All right. Um, let's I balance this, Mr. Before we have for Samus. We haven't done that yet. Oh, yeah. Balance. Our nitrate has a three here and a two here, so that's that six business. Yeah. So I'm going to make them a six, so that's going to make this a two and this a three. That's going to create an aluminum, two aluminum, so I have to put a two here. And i got three bariums. I'm going to put a three there. So that's the balanced equation. Usually we like to do that in a long line. Probably should have. Sorry. So that's how you do single replacement reactions. You can do lots of these. The key thing, really, guys, is start with the box. Check who's the good-looking guy. And once you've got that done, make the reaction. And wear a kilt and you're better looking. Not. Not at all. Ouch. No. No. All right. I'm cutting you off.